Hi, I'm CJ with BirdDog, and in this video, I'm gonna show you how you can use BirdDog Cloud's presenter control to switch and control NDI sources right on your web browser. So let's go ahead and set it up and show you exactly how this works. If I go over to my desktop here, you can see I have two images. One's gonna show the video and the other will show presenter control. So to start, what I'm gonna do is go to CJ Home and I'm going to add a new connection. Now, the difference here is this is gonna be a multi-view connection. So once I do that, I have auto grid, two plus eight, and presenter mode, which presenter mode is gonna be allowing me to give control to switch my NDI sources. I can do quarter, a third, or a 50-50 split for what I want. I'm gonna do a third. Here is my presentation source, which this is a vMix NDI output. My first video source, I'm gonna choose this P100, and then for my additional source, I'm gonna do my P4K, which was the camera that I opened up this video with. From there, we can choose a background image if we want. This would just be a still PNG to go behind the third split that we have. So I'm gonna choose that guy right there. Then you can also put in a single overlay if you want a graphic or something like that. So I can do a simple image. Um, this I don't really have cropped down, but you'll get the idea with this. Then I can go to FPS, I'm gonna choose 60, 19, 20 by 1080, high quality. I'm gonna choose five megabits. VP9 is my codec, and I'm gonna send this to my video test group that I have. Then for display name, I'm gonna choose CJ Prez Feed. And then I hit connect. Now I have that connection ready to go. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna hit more, cloud connect streams, video test, and there's my Prez Feed. And there we go, there's my one third split. So you can see I have my NDI program feed and then I have my P100 camera here on the right. So on the right screen, let's go to presenter control. So if I hit more presenter control, this will show that connection that I have. So if I hit control this connection, this will bring me into the page where I can actually switch NDI sources. So if I want this video feed to be full screen, for instance, if I click this for output selection, there we go. I'm switching right on a web browser. If I want that P100 to be full screen, I click that. If I want my P4K that we started with, I click that. And if I want to mix the sources with my presentation source, I can do my P4K image right here, or I can do that P100. It's that easy. You can switch it all right on a web browser using any web URL. Then I also mentioned I had that overlay so I could fade in this graphic, which doesn't look very good, but you get the idea. And then what's crazy is you can even control the PTZ within this presenter control. So this P100 that I have, for instance, if I go down to here and select it and I zoom in, you can control the PTZ right in presenter control. You can also do pan and tilt, and then you can even do presets. You can flip around if I wanna do the P4K. If I wanted to control this camera, for instance, you can do that right in presenter control. It really kind of marries a lot of great features right on a web browser. So that's pretty much the rundown of what presenter control to do. And we hope you guys find this useful and can't wait to see what y'all do out in the field. For more information, please visit birddog.tv or if you have any pre-sales or workflow questions, feel free to email us at hello at birddog.tv. Thanks and have a great day.